You know how mad this book made me? It's going in the trash when I'm done with my lunch. It's going in the trash. It made me so mad. Like the... Mood, okay? Mood, and I don't care. Yeah. You know how some alleys just be creeping you out? Currently experiencing that because I'm waiting on a pickup order and the way to go through to pick it up, real sketch. Real sketch. It's okay. And that's why I'm recording. <laughs> it's like, no. Like, I wonder if, like, because it's, um, what's really weird is I didn't even know these existed anymore, but there's like sound rooms I know real random like why is it here but <laughs> but you know people can use it for studying use it for uh, like band recitals or rehearsal if you will so I remember there were sound rooms in college they were real nice but yeah there's just random places of business have is y'all city like that because you know i've seen some very weird combos i've seen a wendy's and a uh, like a sleep mattress place i've seen a dentist place and a game stop what are you gonna get a root canal and then get the newest madden i don't <laughs> what are we doing it's just random stuff like that and it's interesting to see it seems like in just general in the tri-state area there's like a trying to have like a revamp I guess where a lot of run down and old buildings are in cities even it's like I get the revamp I get it but are you going to pay the people the salary to be able to enjoy the revamp? Hmm? Just, just a random topic, you yeah. know? I mean, it's nice that they're attempting. But again, it's just like, it. everything to me I see as a balanced type of thing. Sure, it may look all nice or whatever, but can people afford to do stuff? <laughs> and then when the salary that seems to be a null and void at this point for so many people but if that happens are they going to disrespect the property and the businesses and not care you know or regard for staff and I just I think about this stuff when I see new businesses because I'm in a business mind and you know customer based so that's just me speaking of that if you haven't already checked out the updates to my candle site i'm talking prices have been cut shipping has been cut go get you one two three four five okay get all the sets just don't get one get all of them okay because you're not going to waste your time, you're not gonna waste your money, you're not gonna waste the quality because top tier. I use top tier vessels, lids, wax, you name it. Down to the wick is high quality. It's a little bit too high quality, and people don't <laughs> want to necessarily, you know, have big business prices and they don't want to pay for independent people. So I'm being cognizant of that. So Hey, the vessels may change in the future when I'm sold out of the ones that I have. And I know it's summer. I know it's a slow peak. I just didn't want to be like everybody else and start making the body butters and the scrubs and all that. Mind you, I did start try to formulating a perfume, but I didn't want to release it yet because I just... Mm -hmm. Perfumery is a part of my self-care in general 
I just was trying to at least supplement something for the spring and summer, but I just said no because my candles are worth it and people buy candles year round. So I'm just, I'm not going to compromise my thought process and I'm not going to rush anything. So speaking of not rushing anything too, I have an end goal business in mind that's going to pretty much be an encompassing thing, multifaceted business or company, whatever if you will, that hones in on the self-care part of things, mental health, and so on with my passion for something. I'm not going <laughs> to give it out yet because it's still in infant stages, but I don't know if I mentioned this, but I came to realize a few years back when I was developing the sites that I have now when it came to fruition, like doing a lot of research and so forth to be able to make the product and so on and become a reseller with my other website. Um, with that, it's like I knew that I wanted to create, keep creating things. I knew I did not want to just be blah in my creative space because one thing about it, your girl is a creative, right? What in my written skills, okay, up there. I just understand that one of the avenues that I will always feel like I want to take now mind you my creativity is an ebb and flow type of thing too there were years where my keep my creativity just shut off the light switch went completely down I was dull I didn't know nothing I didn't want to do nothing all that right so now that it's back the girl's full force and there's dragonflies get away from me I gotta roll my windows to be hot. Because dragonflies want to be distracting me and try and fly in my window. Mind you, the dragonflies here, honey, huge. Mutated, I don't, I don't care. I don't want to know. But, is it going, child? Cause I don't play that. Mind you, insects, they don't typically bother me, but the winged ones sometimes, yeah, they be bothering me. So, but what was the saying? Oh, creativity. Mm -hmm. That is me. And I will continue to do so. But I appreciate you letting me just pass some time, you know, speaking to y'all before I had to because it's a time sensitive type of pickup. So, it's food. <clears throat> I'm trying to be mysterious and whatnot. Okay, airplane, being loud. It is a nice day to fly. It really is. Um, uh, yeah. About to go pick up this food and grub. And see where else this video takes me and you. Come on. So I got off a little bit early. Mind you, welcome to the vlog. Cause I just opened up with the whole uh, situation with the book. I'm going away for the weekend just to visit my mom cause she don't live nowhere close to me. So it's kind of like a staycation to me because I cannot deal with my neighbors and I need actually a quality night's sleep through the weekend. So that's what we're gonna do.
And just like that, we are here. Um, it got real gloomy almost over here. Now I'm just waiting for her to come on down because she apparently went a little thrift store shopping today. Not sure if she got anything pertaining to resale value, but we will see. And then I gotta unpack my luggage and stuff, so that's gonna take a little bit. So let's see where this weekend, you know, takes us because I do want to take her to a winery of some sort. So see if that's possible. We'll see what the weather's looking like and if the vibes are right. Why not? Because we've been trying to do that all summer. So, just in the right time too. So, that's what we're going to do. Alright. Let me get out this car. And then I apparently I missed a spot up here too because I just saw it with the sun and all that. And they're like, it never dried. So what the, what the Sam shit <laughs> is in Windex that don't make it dry for real? And I already need a dusting. I just, Lord, why is the earth so dusty? Please shout. Mm. I'm doing a detail all over again. Cause gotta keep it pristine and mean, okay? So we gotta do. Okay. It is the next afternoon. I'm looking crusty right now, but that's okay, cause we're about to get ready so that way we can go a little adventure time outside. Just a onesie short little situation. But we're gonna get dolled up a little bit. Same hairstyle, the iconic bun with the pieces in front, of course. But let me go transform into something real quick. So this building right here, we passed, mind you, with my mom. Last time I was here, maybe a month and a half ago, right? We passed by here, it says, oh, Italian herbs. I wonder what's in there. We, we're taking adventures right now, right? So we walk in, I instantly smell the cannabis. I said, we walked immediately out. She was like, I hope it's a, Thought it was a holistic uh, healing situation. I said that's what we does, ma'am. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So.
So we're thinking it's cooking spices, it's all the good stuff. No. I mean, you want to join? It's legal now. No? Okay. Winery it is. Okay, let's go. My mom is picking all the worst places today. See, this is why I plan everything. I said, this is why I plan everything. <laughs> At least we tried. At least we tried. But yeah, not this place. Mm -hmm. On to the next one. So in the midst of trying to find a winery to go to. Cadillac. Right. to a car show so hmm. you might take a closer look you never know it's all the way over there too this is a classic car thunderbird look at those rings inside is clean too Wow. Nice. Now this is one of my dad's favorite cars. Black interior. GTO. For sure. Do you see what's in this? This is cooped up, souped up, all that. Look at that front. <sighs> yeah, that's nice. The majority of it is This is a Ford. Look at that. Pristine. I want to say it's a candy red with tan interior. Beautiful. I saw two of them. I should let them know where it could tell them. Come over and tell them. I mean, it doesn't need to be going any kind of problem. Look at this Bel Air. These are the vibes that I need. This is the vibe that I need for a classic. Look at this interior. Look at this interior. Look at this interior. Low riding. Side. Well. <laughs> oh, and it's right side up. Wow. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look at this beautiful color. Look at the dash. Mm, 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 mm. I love the stitching. Right. And it's still all original interior. Beautiful.
Native American grape is giving culture. Okay, with the okay, with the swirl. Gotta do the little air pockets situation. Let me get you water. Okay. 
Sounds good. We'll have you a video this next time. And then, did you want to set some? I'm about to get ready for this massage because like I said, in need, okay? But I just went to get a drink right across the street, well, technically next door. But yeah, we're about to get this 90 minute in and then we're gonna go to a restaurant after that and probably get drinks, a little appetizer or something and vibe out because it's too nice to be inside. Okay, for a recap, because after my massage, I was mad hungry, so I just went to a restaurant. I got fish and chips. Didn't record that because I just started grubbing. It was busting. Um, that massage, 1500 out of 10. It was so great. Like, I literally never fall asleep with a therapist. It's the first time I ever fall asleep with a massage therapist, and I was like, wow. And it's like, she didn't even do anything that I wasn't like used to or anything, but maybe it's because I haven't been in a while and it was a lengthier session. So, that was so nice. Now I gotta get into the cribbo and unpack everything that I accumulated over the weekend because I got, mind you, I already have a crock pot, but it's like super small, but I wanted to have like a bigger one for a larger meal prep situation so I got a bigger one yay for me and I got some other items well well what was it the crock pot and I got the new bottle of wine didn't show you guys that so I'll show you it's so good because I tasted it at the one of the wineries we went to 19% child Mm hmm you heard me right, 19% alcohol in this wine. And it's a dessert wine, so, yeah, you're going to be feeling nice. So, yeah, this weekend slash week was really nice. Like, to me, it was like one of those movie type of moments where you, like, never wanted to end and it was, like, so unexpected and it turned out fantastic, you know what I'm saying? So nice. So, I'm going to end this episode and vlog here. You know, just click that bell, smash it, like it, comment, share with your peoples. Because I know I'm a vibe to somebody. So, keep sharing this thing. Let's continue to grow together, okay? So, until next time, take care.